Hey guys, hope you're all well. Ali here, welcome to the channel. Okay, so in today's video, I've gone to Dean's Fried Chicken. Like the name suggests, they do lots of like, fried chicken, <laughs> but they're actually quite popular for peri peri chicken as well. So got a little bit of mixture of both, and I saw something on the menu that I'm not seeing uh, in sort of similar takeaways as well. So super excited to, to crack on, so nothing to it but to do it. So uh, let's start the review. Okay, so I've actually got a lot of dishes and I also do a saver menu as well, which I'll review at the end. So if you want to know about the saver menu, make sure to stay by to the end. I'll do the stuff that they're quite popular for first. Um, there is actually, I don't know if the camera can pick up, there's a lot of food in front of me, so it's a little bit overwhelming actually. So let's go with, let's just go with a Perry burger to start with, because that's something that a lot of people tell me to get. I mean, these guys are quite famous for the actual, their Perry chicken. So I'll give that a go. It's looking pretty good. Oh, really good amount of kick to it. Oh, really good amount of kick to it. I need to try that again. Verified my first thought. Wicked kick to it. There's a decent amount of mayo in there just to mellow that out. That's absolutely delicious. The meat's actually got like a little bit of a char to it where they've been cooking it on the grill. That gives it an extra element of flavor as well. Really good sized chicken breast as well. That is absolutely delicious. There's so much to review guys, I'm actually going to move on nice and quickly, don't want to keep it too long. Now we're going to do the fried chicken burger. I've done the peri burger, so why not do the fried one? Like I said, they're actually more famous for that. Also actually, their chili sauce is supposed to be good, so I'm going to dip the fried burger into the chili. Why not? Burger's not bad at all. It's pretty good value from what I remember. All the prices and everything will be in the description. The actual batter. It's pretty good. I would like it a touch more flavoured, if uh, you know, if I'm being honest. Maybe a little bit more salt would be would be great. The size of the actual burger itself is good, so good value in that regard. The burger is pretty good, but there are some much better places that I've been to, like you know, like the Phillies and the Floridas and the Miamis. But again, if your friends are going for the Perry and you don't fancy Perry, that's not bad. That's pretty good. The chili sauce, on the other hand, that gets a definite hey man. That's absolutely delicious. Yeah, just a quick shout out to the guy because, like I said, the chili sauce is amazing. Ask for one, he's given me five and I've worked in like takeaways, kebab vans, things like that and everyone's had that boss whereby it's never the owner, it's always the guy who works under him who will give you maybe you know the boss will be like listen brother I told you give them 47 chips, why are you giving them 48 chips for? <laughs> it's always nice when you get given a little bit extra shout out to that guy. Ooh, let's go for, they've got barbecue wings which I haven't seen on uh, a menu for a little while for takeaways so these look absolutely massive. Good size these guys right? They look really, really juicy, really wet. And like I said, these are massive. Mm. Hey man, that is delicious. Sometimes I can find barbecue a bit too sweet, but that's got the right amount of sweetness, tanginess to it as well. Massive, again, really large piece of meat, super soft, that's delicious. I'm shocked because again, I don't like barbecue. I thought I'd get it because it's a bit different. I would be getting that again, 100%. I have to just wash my hands because they were like super juicy, super wet, but delicious. But on the subject of wings, those were, like I said, the barbecue wings. Let's give the hot wings a go. These actually have a fantastic color to them. I like that. They have just a lovely sort of orange tinge to them, almost like a red. That looks delicious. Again, I must note, these wings are absolutely massive and they're pretty cheap as well. Mmm. So far, the consistency in the meat has all been delicious, all been cooked really well. I'm loving that batter, it's got a really good amount of crisp to it. Not super spicy, but the barbecue wings are absolutely knockout. These are very good as well. I, think I, I didn't think I would say this, but I think I'd pick them over these. I picked the barbecue over the hot wings, but these are still delicious. Still uh, quite a few things to go guys, so thank you for staying by. Let's actually go for the peri chicken now. Now this is a platter and the portion of rice is probably the largest portion of rice I have ever seen in a platter. It's absolutely ginormous. It's half a chicken there, a bit of salad as well. Literally the entire like tray is full of rice. Like it's just a massive portion guys. Now like I said, I do like the chili sauce, but because I'm reviewing, I've not had this before. I'm just not using the chili sauce because I want to try the things individually as they are. And then I can use that condiment really at the end. The peri chicken is pretty good. I think the actual peri flavor itself could do with some work actually. It's not got much of a punch. The meat is, I would say a touch on the, on the dry side as well. It's certainly not a bad peri peri, but we're so lucky here in Manchester to get so many great options. Um, this, however, is, it's pretty good. Like I said, it's certainly not bad. It's not super dry. It's a touch on the dry side, if I'm being picky. And the flavor on the peri itself could be seasoned a bit better and it could just have a bit more flavor to it. 
Let's try the rice as well whilst we're at it. The last couple of Perry places I've been to, not been in love with the rice, but this is probably the best rice I've had in the last few places I've been to. So the rice is actually really good. Shame about the chicken. I quite enjoyed the rice. But let's just move on to something else. Now on to the pound saver menu. So I did not know this was really a thing. Only since I've been reviewing, I've been seeing lots of places that do like pound menus. So uh, Players had a, a burger for £1.14. Pepe's had a burger, I think it was a pound or somewhere around that mark. These guys have got a full pound menu. So you've got the beef burger, which is £1.20. Uh, you've got the chicken strip burger, which is £1. And you've got two strips for a pound as well. So let's try these. Going for the cheeseburger first. Yo. For one pound? That is not bad at all. That's probably on a similar level to players. I really enjoyed that burger because you can get maybe something like a Piri burger with chips and drink and have this as maybe like an add-on. Just add on to the meal, it's a quid. I think that's well worth it. Or sorry, I should say this is actually one pound 20. But even so, it's worth that kind of price, especially if you've got kids and whatnot. I know my nieces and nephews, some of the meals they're just not gonna finish, but something like this, they'd happily finish. All right, let's move on to the chicken strip burger. And it is literally one chicken strip in a little bun. Let's give that, give that a go. Mm. I can live without that. I'm not loving the batter on that. It's the chicken itself, the touch dry, not much flavor. Maybe a little bit of their chili sauce on that will be fantastic. In fact, let me just try. Cause I've tried it without the chili sauce. So given a fair review, but let me see if it makes it better if I just use a little bit of chili sauce. That's much better. <laughs> If you are going to get the mini chicken burger, I still wouldn't necessarily recommend it, but as some of the chili sauce, that's amazing. It makes that really, really good. Moving on to these strips. Now you get two of these, pretty good size for a pound. And again, I think that's a pretty good add on to a meal actually. Exactly the same thoughts as I had with the chicken strip burger, because of course the chicken strip burger is just literally a strip in the burger, the bit of mayo and a touch of lettuce maybe about three strands of lettuce. So I would probably, uh, probably avoid the strips. I'm not a massive fan of these. I would probably let them go. But again, if you like chicken, just dip them into the chili sauce. That'll improve your experience uh, a lot. Oh, I nearly forgot actually. I got a piece of chicken as well. Um, I got a lot of food from these places actually. Let's give the chicken a go. Sorry, I'm just manhandling this. Sometimes I forget I'm being recorded and people are gonna watch this. I assume no one watches. Um, and I just start manhandling my food. So let's try the chicken. Oh gosh. that. I've manhandled that. Mm. I guess I'll see a theme here with the fried pieces of chicken, um, the chicken strip and the chicken burger. They're pretty good, they're serviceable. Uh, they're not gonna set you back a lot, it's pretty cheap. But I would say there are better alternatives out there. However, just bear with me. Whilst I've said that, the Perry Burger, these barbecue wings and the hot wings are absolutely knockout. So I would 100% recommend these. However, I would definitely stick to the Perry Burgers. I hear the Perry Wrap is really good, but I'm not a super big fan of wraps, so I, I didn't get it. Um, the barbecue wings are unbelievable, and I like the hot wings as well, so that's what I would get. I just wanna say, lately I've noticed there's been a big upsurge in uh, likes, in comments. I appreciate every single like you drop, and I appreciate every comment you make on the video as well. As you guys are probably aware, those kinds of interactions help small channels like myself. It basically tells YouTube, people are liking this content and it starts recommending me to other people, start basically showing my video to other people. So I really, really appreciate all the comments, all the likes, all that kind of stuff. Uh, but if you do want to see more and you like the video, make sure to like the video and subscribe to see more. And I'll see you in that next video. Bye, 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 bye.